What about exercise? Your favorite topic? <laughs> is there uh is there I don't pod- like talking about it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. Great. Is there benefits to longevity uh, from exercise? Well, no doubt. That's that's proven. Um, just like fasting, it's pretty clear that that works. Uh, for example, there are studies of cyclists. It was something like people that cycle over 80 miles a week have a 40% reduction in a variety of diseases, certainly heart disease. So that that's not even a question. But what's interesting is that we're learning that you don't need much to have a big benefit. It's an asymptotic curve. Um, and in fact, if you overdo it, you probably have reduced benefits, particularly if you start to wear out joints, that kind of thing. But just 10 minutes on a treadmill a few times a week, getting your, lose your breath, get hypoxic, as it's called, seems to be very beneficial for long-term health. Um, and that's the kind of exercise that I like to do, aerobic. <laughs> Though I, I do enjoy uh, lifting weights, so that is what I call my exercise, which has other benefits, including maintaining hormone levels, male hormone levels, but also really why I do it is um, I want to be able to counteract the effects of sitting for most of the day. Yeah. And as you get older, you lose muscle mass. It's a percent or so a year. And I don't want to be frail when I'm older and fall over and break my hip, which is which happens every 20 seconds in this country. So maintaining that strength, but also doing the cardio for the, for the longevity, for the avoiding the heart disease. 